Amy, you are my favorite person and my best friend. This moment here with you is a testament of God's love and faithfulness over the years. I still remember the first time I saw you all over four, four years ago at church camp. I never seen a cuter face and I haven't either since. I just knew I had to get to know you and while that did take a whole 11 months to happen when we finally spoke I knew you were the girl that I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. I love everything about you but most of all how you love me. You're the most beautiful girl I've ever seen uh, whether you're wearing your clothes or mine. Whether you're wearing the ugly nighties you get on the road or even this amazing gown. I cannot put into words the joy and gratitude I feel at the thought of spending the rest of my life with you. I know it's not going to be easy but with you by my side I have no doubt in my mind that we can overcome anything that comes our way. I vow to love you and respect you, to honor you and even cook nice malu food for you. To serve you and support you in whatever God has called you to do and be the best father I can be to our children. It goes without saying that Kyle has the most beautiful smile anyone has ever seen. So I vow to make you happy, but not just that. I vow to delight in your happiness, which is inclusive of when you go to play football up to three times a week. <laughs> your ambitions, goals and dreams I will treat as my own. I will be supportive and do my part to make sure we meet our God-ordained callings. I promise to be for you the helpmate God intended from the beginning. I will honor you as my spiritual head and I will follow you as you follow Christ. I cannot emphasize this enough, but you've always been the calm to my panicky thunderstorm, my place of comfort and solace. You've always got a solution and so it's easy for me to vow to trust you and to always value your opinions and stand by your actions. If you ever grow weak, I vow to fight your battles with you. presence of God and all these witnesses, I, Kyle, take you, Amy, to be my wife, to have and to hold from this day forward for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish till death do us part. I love you. I vow to love you in the good times and in the bad, when life is easy and when it seems hard. When love is simple and when it takes an effort, I vow to cherish you always. I love you. With this token, I wed you and endow you with all my worldly goods in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. With this token, I pledge you my vow in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit.
satisfies like you do the fountain that won't run dry nothing satisfies like you do Thank you.